Welcome back to the Ghost Key. I am Gray, and today I'm gonna kill some big ass salamanders. Sounds like a plan. It does to me. Anyhow, I'm gonna warn you now that I'm a bit tired. So if I kind of like just trail off and don't make any sense for a while, that's why. Just letting you know. It's a bit late. Not really a bit late. It's I'm just tired. I'm having just, just tired, just tired. But we are gonna get some real work done today, I think. Um, mostly because um, all we gotta do is kill these guys, and we are level nine, so um, with any luck, we'll get some real levels, and then we'll. Oh shit! I don't want to stand in that. What the hell that is? Yeah, hopefully we'll get some levels here and uh, be able to do like level 10 shit. Because I think around there, like, the story actually gets, uh, you know, constructive if you will. Oh, fuck that. I have none of that shit. Yeah, get fucked, asshole. Anyhow, um, wow. You really got some ups in this game, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, you fucking sky in this game. It's ridiculous how much he can run. What the fuck? That's a person. I thought that was a fucking monster for a second. I was like, oh shit! I don't want it. Some ultra rare bullshit that just spawns to kill you. A bit scared there for a second. Alright, we got one more effed and then we're done with this. Yeah, take that jackass. Should've casted the stone thing first. But oh well, whatever. It is what it is. Yeah, fuck you. And, uh, take more rocks to the fair. Alright, are we good here? I think we are. Alright, we are done. So let's get on out of here. Um, I have no idea what what really is um, on the horizon in terms of quests. Like I said, I think, I think they actually get, you know, constructive to the point where, you know, you actually start doing some more stuff like we did with that um, big ass tree thing here soon if you remember that I think it's what second episode there we go okay so we've um, you know we've uh, reinvigorated his bitches I guess I don't know it's kind of irritating that we don't oh they, they do have a wand I was gonna say, it's kind of irritating that we don't have a item that we can use there but anyway all right, spirit hold broken. What in the hell? Oh, we're just gonna investigate some shit. Oh, cutscene time! Yay! All right, we have to listen well, pay attention, cause I'm not going to. Cause I just usually don't. All right. Anyway, someone was attacked by a towering shadow. They do have some weird weird names for things just in general they really do in this game like he just called I assume some troops that he dispatched to the to the spirit hold to handle some shit called quivermen I mean that's kind of weird I mean just like I said they just have a very unique very unique vocabulary in this game I'm gonna say that. Sometimes it's a little weird, a little, a little much. But there we go. Now we have a new, new whack ass stick. All right. So where in the hell do we have to go? We have to go. Oh, down there and zone into some shit, huh? All right then. I guess we're we're gonna go that way. And. I don't think, um, have anything, anything weird happening, I don't think. Shouldn't, anyway. We're going, are we going back into this hole? Is this where we're supposed to fucking go? No, we're gonna go that way. Hi, guys. Remember when I killed a bunch of you, like, two minutes ago? Yeah. Oop, angry tree. It's one thing that's weird, like, they just get... It's got a lot of like a really wide range of weird shit in this game. 
Wait till you see like the goblins and stuff. They are not what you would think goblins would look like. Ever. Ever. Oh, we got fates nearby. Yay. I like I do like the fates. I think that's I think that's cool. Oh shit, you know what this means. See these little motherfuckers over here? Time to kill them for some easy XP. I think these are great. I really do. I, I like the idea of these little the little uh, kill quests like this. I mean, they're just simple, tiny little things. You only gotta kill a handful of them at best. It's it's smart, and they do give you a nice chunk of experience too. I mean, it's not like it's just a tiny little bit. Obviously, when you're out level for the shit, it's not nearly as effective. But I mean, for this being level eight, more level nine. I mean, this could this could give us a pretty pretty nice chunk of change in terms of a. Uh, experience but that's just you know like I said it's, it's neat shit I like things like this it gives you a reason to kind of just wander and I like that I like finding my own path in um, in video games yeah pretty far actually yeah this next quest high quality items what did we get I obtained a high quality item the hell did we get I wasn't uh Army. Nope, not you. Nothing new. Nothing new. Uh, nothing new. Nope, nothing new. I don't fucking know what we got. I wasn't paying attention. Mm. But supposedly we obtained a high quality item. Oh, it's this. Oh, yeah, that's right. The, um. Crafting materials can be high quality and stuff like that. That's right. This game is very craft heavy, which is nice, too. Um, the reason it's nice is because, you know, you can actually make your own shit. Rescue the missing conjurers and wood whalers. Alright, guys. To kill these trickster imps. Which are kind of cartoony. And if you're fucking Christ, that thing happened again. Jesus. I do like that thing in the mouth, though, though. Ah, shit, I don't remember the name for it right now, but it does look pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. They're over in, um, like, uh, um, whatever you want to call it, the place where Limsa, or Lim, yeah, Limsa, Lominsa. I think that's what it's called. I think they're over there. You see them kind of walking around and shit. Alright, get, get, uh, get out of here, you little bitch. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Punk ass. Can't hold your shit. Can't fight nothing. It's a little punk. Get scared. My god, what is with its eyeballs? This thing looks like a fucking alien. Holy shit. Like I said, the art in this game can get really weird sometimes. Really weird. Really, really weird. Yep. You're a little bitch. Just get out of here. You suck. You don't deserve to wear the mask. Or something, I don't know. I, I assume that those masks have some sort of significance to them, but... I really don't care. In all honesty. And that's something I uh, invest any time in giving a shit about. Boom. Alright. That might be all we need to kill. Because we might be able to skip through here. And, uh, yeah, get out of here. Little scared little bitch. All right, hopping up the stairs. Like the environment in this game is really cool, I think. But like some of the art for the monsters is just weird. I mean, as you've already seen the giant ass mosquitoes, these weird fucking imps. Oh, come on. Thank you, Jesus. Fucking target the right thing. I do have to say we do have a good chunk of um, health and we're pretty, we're pretty tough. I'm kind of surprised. I mean, I, I honestly expect it to be Taking hits and um, you know having to heal every fight, but we don't have to. In fact, we're about to take two of these fucking things on, and I'm gonna be really pissed that they're just gonna keep spawning back here and keep us from getting this last guy because that's gonna be a little annoying. I mean, we just took two of these things that were equal level, right? I believe they're wolf level nine, and we wouldn't really need to heal. I'm going to heal just for shits and giggles, but you know, didn't really need to. 
like I said, very happy about that. That's kind of nice. It's kind of different um, to actually roll a healer or a mage class and, you know, not have to heal every fucking two minutes. Oh, shit. We actually have to continue walking through here, huh? Rescue the hearer. Um, I guess something's supposed to happen in here. Oh, shit. All right, then. Let's do this. Or something. I don't know. I don't know what it's what's what's about to happen. I'm scared. Terrified. This guy's like a, I want your hat. Can I have your hat? Oh, we're getting into this shit now. Oh shit. Boss fight time. Hell yeah. Sad Viking says, What the fuck? Oh shit. Oh shit. Ah! I'll beat you off with my stick and board, my cutting board. Yep. I look real menacing with that with fucking mittens on and a little twig and a fucking cutting board. Oh Jesus. Like I said, some of this some of the shit in this game is goofy, even though it's not intending to be. It is. And through the course of being goofy, I mean kinda it's kind of lighthearted, and that's kind of nice. It's one of those things that I think see, it was always best. When it was at its best, that's what it did. I mean, it always had like a good, a good mix of comedy and lightheartedness along with, you know, the, the seriousness of, you know, everything that's going to happen. Oh, shit. Now he's going to start doing some crazy shit here. Oh, fuck you. I'm out. Nope. Not hanging around on that. There's like no damage too, unless you get caught in the bad shit. But like I said, I mean, uh, I think that's one of the things that's really um, made um, Final Fantasy shitty, especially Final Fantasy 13, is um, they're they're just too serious. I mean, I, I don't I don't think I've bitched about this yet. Oh fuck that! Oh fuck that! I don't want none of that shit. None of that. One of the things that really made Final Fantasy XIII shitty, in my honest opinion, and I did play all three of them. I just, it was just too serious. Too, too much, too much pent up rage. Honestly, just too much of that shit. You know, fucking Lightning was just a bitch the whole time, and just, like I said, too, too, um, it's too high strung and there's no comedy there's no you know light-hearted spells in the game where you know none of the characters were even you know allowed to be any of that either I think you know I don't think any of the characters were written and intended to be light-hearted characters to kind of contrast like Quina or something in FF um, 9 you know but and I think that was really a big a big you know letdown is this is a weird angle. Oh, okay. All right. Oh. Who dat? Who dare? Mm, no one. I'm sad. Sad Viking. So sad. I want to cry. Yes. Cry. But anyhow. Like, even if F10 had comedy in it through the main character, through Titus being kind of a goofball. Damn nation. Jesus, really? Damn nation, he has eluded us again. Alright. How are things? Well, I'm a badass, so... Oh, nap time! Not oh, fuck my head. I need naps. And donuts. I need some fucking donuts. I could go for a donut right now, I'm not gonna lie. Big ass fucking glazed donut. Mmm, tasty shit. Maybe I'll do that in the morning. Maybe, maybe I'll go get me a donut. Just maybe. Just maybe. Well, we'll see. Oh, dream sequence. Fuzzy. Oh. <laughs> Did he just do this little fucking spin and <laughs> hide? Uh. Funny shit. Oh, we're gonna summon that primal. 
I believe that's code for summon. I think. I think that's what they call them in this game. Ah, yes. Big ass ominous orb in the sky. Can't have a Final Fantasy game without one of those. Oh, yeah, the Garleans. Now you're starting to be introduced to the Garleans and shit like that and, and stuff. And stuff. Yeah, I believe primals are. And summons or whatever. Whatever you want. We already blab blab blab. Whatever you feel like calling them. Agreed. We get badass neck tattoos. What? Wah! Is she crying? Or just fell over? Stupid things. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. Yes, they are ugly. You look absolutely fucking goofy with those things on. Absolutely. I mean, I wouldn't be able to walk with that shit. Yes, five years. Oh, she doesn't have hers on anymore. I was like, why do you have her ears on, but he doesn't have his on? What's what's with that shit? Oh yeah, Ramu. Oh, good old Ramu. Old oh, crazy guy. Ah. Things are falling from the sky. <laughs> I like how they avoid actually them them actually you know putting putting these things on I just you know dip out of the out of the frame and then oh that's on my face now we must hurry to the stump of shit all right then I do like how they kind of just they talk about things but they don't explain word for word you know specifically what you need to know that's one thing that's kind of nice like i don't like it in some games where they just pick up in the middle of shit and nothing's explained like final fantasy 13 they did that in 13 and like they just pick up and they're talking about fucking pulselessy and falsy and all this shit you're like what the fuck is going on you know at least you have some idea you know they're giving you the history of the world so you know when they're like oh it's been five years you know you kind of understand you know it and they kind of talk about things you know in in a way that is isn't entirely like over like it's not too much you know what i mean like they talk about things but they're not just going on and on and on about all this shit as if you need to know what it's like you need to fucking read a pamphlet to understand all the vocabulary that they're using you know that's one thing that's nice. Like how they were talking about the primals, and you're like, uh, okay. And then they mentioned Ramu, so I'm like, oh, fuck. So that means primal is their version of fucking guardian forces or summons eidolons, whatever you feel like calling them. That's something that's kind of nice about this game. They do a decent job with the text of making it interesting and dropping hints, but not making it too fucking confusing and too wordy. We're like, what the fuck is going on? Who are these people? And why should I even give a shit? But anyhow. Yes. You would like our quest experience. Thank you very much. I know your names, bitches. Ida! We're surveying shit. Yeah, remember when we met earlier? Unless you guys forgot. You and your little hot pants. Yes, she's wearing hot pants. <sighs> Something familiar about though. Could it be that you are... Yeah, remember when we met earlier? Or are you just saying, Oh, 
Why does it feel like you're badass? Oh, because you- Man, that guy has like fucking waddles. His fucking arms. Wah, 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 wah. Look like little fucking penguins. Oh, Jesus. Malalafell are some interesting little fuckers. Interesting little fuckers. Okay. Alright, can we get out of here? Without pissing off all these imps. No. Oh, shit. Fuck it, I'm just gonna run anyway. I'm just booking it, because their blizzard only does a tiny little bit of damage. And... I just don't care to fight these guys. Fuck them. I'm just gonna run till they tether and then run back to Alliston and be like, Yo bitch, your shit's done. Give me quest rewards. Alright, I think they're done. That's one thing that's kinda nice. The, the, they don't tether, or they're... Their um, like the aggro radius and their tether length isn't too bad in this game. You can kind of outrun pretty much anything. You know, at least out in the you know wandering around and stuff. All right, give me my shit. Give me my shit. Ah, you fucker. Return to Gridania. We're in Gridania, aren't we? Aren't we? Or unless you're talking about New Gridania? New Gridania? Yeah, that's exactly what he's talking about. You should should actually put that in there, New Gridania? Because we're kind of in Gridania. Are, are we not? Are we not? Are we not? But I do like the weather effects in this game. I mean, I think it's neat. That's something that I think a lot of games miss out on. Like, weather effects. I mean, it's just something stupid, but... You know, it makes the game feel real. You know, like, when it's, you know snowing in the winter that's that was one of the things too like when i first played this game it was in the winter and still like the the holiday shit and all that stuff was going on and i mean it was awesome like you you oh shit don't want to fight you like you you know zone into certain places it's just snowing and stuff unless it's story related then it's kind of like set in the way oh i don't even know why i'm going to do that because this episode's going to end here in a second once, once we get our quest rewards and we hit level 10, dropping that shit like it's hot. Yeah? You like that? No? Ah, fuck it. But anyhow. You know, stuff like that I think is neat. You know, you need snow and, you know, things like that to kind of coincide with the season. So that, you know, like I said, it makes the game world feel alive, feel real. You know, because when you look outside and the leaves are all changing color and shit in the fall and... And you see stuff like that in, you know, at least the main city. Like I said, it's kind of it's kind of nice. It makes it feel like, you know, time is actually passing in the game. And you're like, fuck, I should be there. So I might miss out on something. But we are about to zone in here and get our quest rewards. What? Get our experience and we should hit levels. And I'm pretty sure we will. I'm pretty sure. Bye-bye, oh, little midget. The weird little guys. Such weird little guys. In, um, the old die, you do a lot of stuff to Lala fell over there, actual. Actual? Actually. Oh my. More cutscenes. Alright. No, I didn't help them. <laughs> Yeah. Yes, I say. Yeah, give me. Hey, what? Blech. Hey. Mm. Oh. In rooms now available. All right. God damn, those people have long arms. Guild levies. Yay! We have to do that shit now. Um. Those are awesome, because they help you level like a motherfucker. And they're awesome. And they're awesome. And that's probably what I'm going to do mostly if I need to level at any point during the game. Because, you know. Yeah, I'm fucking stoked. Get mittens. I get mittens. Big ass yellow mittens. I'm stoked. Stoked. 
Oh, we leveled C. Told you. Alright then. Turn that shit in. They're gonna tell us about attribute points, which I always forget that we get in this game. So, yeah. However, we do get to move on to Bent Branch Meadows. Yay. So excited. So excited. Not really. It's just, you know, the usual belong to another place. The new more quests there. But like I said, this shit is going to pick up a little bit here soon. However, I am, before we go, before we go, I'm going to do this. I'm going to equip my shit. Oh, you weren't uh, you weren't one of those hats, were you? Oh shit! I don't want to pick that up. I think that's everything that we got, right? Anything, anything else new? Nope. Negatory. All right then. That does it for this episode. If you made it this far on YouTube, you know what to do. Bye now.